Welcome back to Fire Emblem Six Reverse Recruitment. Today we are on the Water Temple, our reward for completing the desert in under 25 turns and keeping chat alive. We don't need here because there are no chests, but there are these tiles that disappear with the water. Um, hopefully it shouldn't be too much of an issue because my plan is just to send Corel, after he uses the boots we obtained, to run down here and kill these guys. Um, this is one of the maps that's easily warp skippable if you do manage to get that staff in the last chapter. Uh, speaking of which, we have our boss, Oats. And this guy over here, both of them have bolting. They both cover each other's ranges. Um, so yeah. This guy, I had a scare with him on Deke once. I think it was like right here. He fought Deke and he criticaled, but it backfired on him with the Devil Axe. And yeah, a lot of pirates, so swords will be useful, but yeah, I do want to send Corel out front. We do have Milady's sword and Sue's sword as well. I am going to be giving out stat boosters this chapter. Um, Corel with the boots. You're getting the speed wings because you're just on the cusp of doubling and not doubling some things, whereas Zeus is just way behind. Yeah, I didn't bring him to this map because there's no room. I'm giving you the body ring, and that was a choice between her and Sophia, but Sophia, I really just plan to make a staff bot, so I think it might be a little bit better on Melina. Might as well use it. Um, I don't think I gave anything to Klino. He was a good choice for, like, the defense shield, but, um, I'm giving it to Sue instead because she, even though I keep forgetting, she does have a melee weapon and it'll help her out some. We do have an energy ring as well, but I'm going to reserve it for, um, I'm going to see if Shayna might need it because she should join in the next chapter. So, I'm um, just going to see who will need that the most. Now, I could put Yoder here. I don't know if they'll go for him. I did put Yoder last in the deployment slot. Uh, like that trick where Faye... Um, people mention with Faye, she can absorb the magic. But we'll see if they even go for him with his really big resistance. He has 26 resistance. So, I don't even know if they're going to bother. Probably not. Corel's just gonna, yeah, he's just gonna come out here. As far as everyone else goes, I'm just going to give them their respective stat boosters. Sue. So, should have probably equipped that. The Berserker traps himself nicely. I'll, um, maybe have Alina kill him. Don't want anyone to really get near him. And there are some archers here, some lady still isn't safe, even though I would love to get her the Draco shield. I believe it's chapter 16 where we fight Narshan. He... Uh, we have to steal that off of him. Probably gonna use Chad since Aster is tied to Ilya, and I don't want to risk losing him. Okay. I don't know if Oats moves first. But he certainly didn't attack Yoder. Okay, you're gonna go for Corel. Interesting. I mean, I'll take it. Much rather you go for Corel, but okay, only the one guy went. Cool. Um. Yeah, he's just going to be stuck clearing the way and getting to the boss. Yeah, not a very exciting chapter. It's one of those guidance I think kind of. Eh, it's just mediocre. Okay, Yoder is in range of this guy. Um, I definitely don't want him taking a Devil Axe potentially to the face. I'd like to send Milady to fight him, but these guys cover that water, so she'll probably have to stay back here. Wanna make sure Lena's on the step, so she should be fine. Of course no one's hurt, so Sophia can't do anything. An archer is going to be annoying. Hopefully, Corel can eventually outrun him with the uh, boots. Yeah, this one once again is going to be the Corel show. Okay, that berserker has positioned himself to get bolted by Lil well, not bolted, but thundered by Lolina. Yeah, you're going to just go there and annoy me. I feel like they're, it's getting to a point where I might need to turn Corel's animations off. Okay, I think you guys might also have long range. 
yeah, you have Eclipse, but didn't even care because Eclipse is bad. Might want to kill him, though. Uh, just so he doesn't go back and bother our other units. Watching the Eclipse animation is quite boring. Alright, I'm going to send you back. Um, what can you do? You can get where Klein is, so I'll have to move him. You have an axe or even not that anyone is really in danger of that. I'd rather not risk you doing anything to us. Even though it would be hilarious to watch a devil axe backfire. Uh, there's no one on this team right now that I would be good with losing. Not even Sophia. Oh, by the way, it was mentioned that um, the item I lost or couldn't remember was the arm scroll. Uh, thank you for that. It did come back to me while I was uh, editing the video. But yeah, it's not something that you... It's not something that you have access to in GBA, sadly, so... Yeah, something that slipped my mind, because I do play GBA a lot more than Fates or Awakening, even though I do like Fates and Awakening. I know some people don't, but I don't mind them. I'm also very illiterate when it comes to, like, um, getting the hacks to work. I know there's one out there that lets you... I don't know if it's finished or not, but it lets you play uh, Conquest, but you get the Birthright characters instead. Uh, that, of course, requires doing stuff with the Citra enemy later, because I don't have the capabilities to record for my actual 3DS. But I'd like to play that one day. Maybe not immediately, because I did play Conquest last year. But I think it would be interesting to do a run like that and see how much harder it would be. I don't think the Birthright characters are really equipped to deal with... Get rid of one. Uh, none of the birthright characters come to mind about being really tanky. You have like Rinka if you want a trainer. I know H Hinata can also be if you reclass him. The tankiest person is honestly Ryomo with the way he dodges. But. Okay. Um... Okay, I'll move Yoder. Yeah, that's a problem for another time. Maybe I should give the strength ring to you, Klein. And then you are hurt. I think Lelina should be good here. Yeah, she should be fine. Um, and I want Sophia to heal. Maybe we can get to a D. It might be possible. I just don't want anyone here aside from Yoda and Lelina to be hit with that stupid bolting. But at least there's a good disbursement of enemies so that both sides can fight. I mean, we have our army broken into two. We have Team Corel, who's doing very good, and then Team Everyone Else. It's kind of like in that um, Awakening map, Chapter 3, where people tend to send Frederick one way up those steps and then everyone else can go the other way. Oh, I prefer to send him to the left because I think the hammer is on the other side. There's like a hammer to trip you up in that map. Yeah, I have a feeling this is going to be a running theme for a good portion of the playthrough. Now, unfortunately, I think Zeus might be benched for the next chapter because I'm planning to have a theme with my team for that one. Um, I've looked at the deployment slots. And I do have to, if you remember, I have to bring Zeus. Or not Zeus. Um, I have to bring Zelot because he is the one who's going to recruit Chlorine, who's Percival. So we do have to make room for him next time. So, yeah, kind of fun stuff there. Okay, that druid is now trapped. It's too bad for him. Right, Corral just making his way up there. What do you have? 
I'm not gonna run her out here, but... Okay, Lena's right out of the range. Um... Okay, I'll keep that on her. Uh, anyone need healing? I don't think so. No one needs to be dance grinded for. That sounded a little dirty, but oh well. Okay, Oats. You actually have a decent hit rate on Corel. You're a bit scarier than the other guys, so I'm just gonna go for you. As long as these guys don't block me in. That's the problem with Corel. He might, um, being that he is a sword master, I don't really have too many options to deal with all these guys. Funnily enough, I actually don't really. Oh, yeah, of course you do that. I'm actually not a big fan of the sword master class, despite some people really liking them. Um, the two range obviously is the biggest issue I have. And of course the foot locked is always a problem in most games. Like I know there's some good ones like Corral or Rutger or Joshua, but eh. Okay, that guy's now stuck. Cool. It's actually not enough. Um I could go with the Wudao. I mean, not like Oats can counter me. Well, through much grinding in the early game. I think Luckus is only, like, non capped out stat. I keep looking at this. Yeah. Um, oh, Sue just kind of got thrown off of the... platform here. Okay, one less pirate. Yeah, some people are kind of just doing nothing and yeah. Uh, we could maybe kill a few more before we take the throne. Alright, another long enemy phase. Hopefully this isn't too lengthy of a chapter. I do like to keep them short, but sometimes it's not possible in games with big maps like this. I think the next one, Chapter 16, are going to be really long. Especially since I think I know who's going to replace Douglas in that map. Um, they're going to have much higher movement than Douglas normally would. So that should be interesting. Because normally you can outrun him or put him to sleep. But... It's going to be a lot more difficult and we have to do it because we want to get the endgame and meet our boy Roy. It's the real reason I'm doing a chapter like this. It'd be funny if these guys didn't know how to swim. He'd be killing his own people. Kind of like the boulder guy in um, Path of Radiance. Maybe pick a few of you. Not that anyone really needs training right now. Most of the people we're getting are going to be promoted. Uh, what do you have? Um. Okay. I think the lady's the only one who can really reach. Yeah, OJ didn't really get to do anything. I think she might be in range of that other... Well, it's a level up, at least. She might be in range of that other, uh, sage. Yes, she is. Well, let's go ahead and just seize the throne. Um, nothing really of value in this chapter, except for the... What did we get here? I think we get... Okay, we get the fitting, because Elena just got to S rank, so... Um, probably put that away until we can actually get to the later maps, but I will see you for the next one.